More parents are coming forward with concerns about a principal accused of stealing money donated to an inner city school. The Vancouver School Board is suing Trisha Lowe for more than $170,000. She worked at Britannia Elementary. But CTV News has learned parents were raising concerns years ago at a different school. Kevin Chirac has the story. In 2014, Barbara Lee reached out to CTV News, saying despite her and other parents' fundraising efforts, it was hard to notice where exactly the money was going to improve John Norquay Elementary. Parents were going in as volunteers, they were making work booklets, kids were sharing textbooks, there, were, there, there was no technology in the classroom. She says she asked for an explanation from the school board at the time, but eventually received a cease and desist order. She and other parents never received an answer. Fast forward to 2023, and the same principal of Norquay back then, Trisha Lowe moved on to Britannia Elementary from 2017 to 2020 and is now facing a lawsuit from the Vancouver School Board alleging Lowe misappropriated funds in excess of $170,000. The board claims she kept money raised through fundraising events for herself, misappropriate donated gift cards, and wrote herself checks. We spoke with one parent from Norquay who now has more questions on just what happened nine years ago. I, I think my first reaction was, wow, can this happen? Um, and, then, and then it was, wait, I'm not surprised. Um, and what happened to, you know, did anything happen during her time at Norway? Krista Sergensen is a school mom who serves on a parent advisory committee and says school budgeting often happens behind closed doors. So when you're talking about donations, especially in-kind donations, things like gift cards or items, are they, are they tracked? Um, who's tracking them? Uh, that's not always clear. So as surprising as this story is, and it is very surprising, I can see how the window is open for this kind of thing happening. CTV News tried reaching out to Trisha Lowe for comment, but didn't receive a response. None of the allegations have been proven in court.